പ്രസിഡന്റ് റോഷൻ സുമേനോൻ അതർ ഡിഗ്നറ്ററീസ് ഓൺ ദ ഡയസ് ഓഫ് ദ ഡയസ് ഇൻ മൈ ഡിയർ ഫ്രണ്ട്സ് ലാസ്റ്റ് ഇയർ ഇറ്റ് സെൽഫ് വൻ സക്കി റിക്വസ്റ്റഡ് മീ ടു കം ഓവർ ടു കാലിക്കറ്റ് ഐ ഗേവ് എ പ്രോമിസ് വെൻ എവർ ഐ കം ടു കാലിക്കറ്റ് ഡെഫിനറ്റ്ലി ഐ വിൽ ഇൻറ്റിമേറ്റ് യു and we can organize a meeting something like that and an opportunity has uh, come out when we had a function at tirur and again another function in iam calicut straight away i intimated roshan and that is the reason for our meeting today here uh, first of all thank you for inviting me uh, uh, unfortunately i was uh, invited many times uh, from calicut management association but uh, i couldn't make up but i'm glad this time at least i got a chance to interact with you good thank you for the nice words about me again thank you very much um uh, and the topic uh, your new president selected uh, my life my message and again Uh, he is having wonderful ideas about uh, giving training to uh, to ministers uh, yeah it's a, it's a very tough job <laughs> yeah in fact i was at iam calicut so uh, uh, roshan was there with the director discussing about the uh, the details uh, that way i have to congratulate calicut management association for taking to much pain uh, to uh, to make uh, our uh, say politicians or our say our leaders at least some vision some some management thoughts i have my own appreciation and uh, uh, my uh, great uh, regards uh, to you all uh, the coming to the point uh, today uh, interacting with you in fact when i was in uh, iam this afternoon the director was insisting me not uh, and not go through too much uh, uh, details uh, it is better to have a interaction that will be better that's why uh, there the students we had a one hour interaction but i had uh, prepared a little bit of information to pass on uh, i we have a i have a powerpoint presentation the Uh, the uh, the advantage of that powerpoint presentation it includes one uh, three minutes clipping which will motivate you uh, uh, three minutes clipping uh, a nice story which will motivate you okay we will come to that point friends uh, whatever said and done uh, no everybody was talking about kerala is not at all a good climate for uh, uh, industries and the number of industries are very less but from my side from my side i have to say that uh, everything is advantages for me because only because of that reason uh, i became a notable person in kerala or in and around kerala uh, whereas if i am uh, if i am in uh, say bangalore or even bombay or delhi or calcutta nobody is going to notice me with a turnover of uh, 820 crores am i right yeah so that way it is a blessing in disguise നമ്മൾ പറയില്ലേ കുരുടനാട്ടിൽ കോങ്ങണ രാജ്യം എന്നൊക്കെ പറയുന്നത് എനിവേ ഫ്രണ്ട്സ് ബട്ട് വെൻ വി അനലൈസ് അനലൈസ് പീപ്പിൾ ദർ ആർ പീപ്പിൾ ഹൂ ഹാവ് കം അപ്പ് ഇവൻ ഇൻ കേരള ദർ ആർ പീപ്പിൾ സിറ്റിംഗ് ഹിയർ ഐ ഡോ വോണ്ട് ടു ഫിഗർ ഔട്ട് ദ നെയിംസ് ദർ ആർ പീപ്പിൾ ഹു ഹാവ് കം ഔട്ട് ഈവൻ വിത്ത് ദ സെയിം കണ്ടീഷൻസ് വിത്ത് ഇൻ കേരള സോ വി കെ നോട്ട് ബ്ലെയിം ദ സിസ്റ്റം but only thing we must have a will we must have a vision uh, so i have uh, come out with uh, a few uh, notes when we observe people when we observe leaders uh, not only any walks of life not, not only industrialist whether he is a politician whether he is a doctor or whether he is an industrialist or a, um, advocate or chartered accountant engineer there are some common qualities among them which makes them as a leader among their category so when we analyze uh, there is a common factor which comes into my mind uh, will you open that first uh, 
So friends, the message which I would like to convey here is nothing but uh, uh, the, the self-development. You take any examples, any, any individuals, any leaders, definitely he or she definitely might have taken a lot of pain to improve himself or herself. Their, uh, their acquiring knowledge is very, very important. No, unless and until in, in your own field, whether you are an engineer, whether you are an industrialist, acquiring knowledge is very important. Uh, that is the prime reason which makes somebody a leader. Then again, uh, the, the, the saddest part, there is no substitute for hard work. You know, we, whatever we say, there is no substitute for hard work. That is the, the, I believe, if there is a capsule, if it is readily available, uh, then, uh, um, but no such capsule is there. Am I right? Yeah. You may get uh, Muslim power, but you won't get a, a ca capsule just replacing hard work. If you take that particular um, uh, tablet, you can avoid hard work. Is there any such type of uh, capsule available? No, unfortunately, no. Uh, the reason is survival of the fittest. Darwin invented the theory of survival of the fittest about nature. But it is still applicable, still applicable with leaders, still applicable with the human beings, still applicable with animals. Am I right? No, no, no doubt about it. Unless and until we excel, in, the, in your own field, one day or other, others will uh, outthrow. We have a army army. We have a lot of army. I hope all of you can understand me. Yeah. Um, Pandate, one day, I am a hero. 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 That may be in the 19th century. The story may be from 19th century, but not for 21st century. Uh, the re just analyze what has happened uh, this uh, Ama and Moil, uh, this uh, tortoise. He never completed his task. Uh, sorry, the, the uh, rabbit never completed his task. Before completing his task, he went for a sleep. Only because of that reason, the, the tortoise succeeded. So it, actually, it is not a, a, a tortoise is not a model, I believe. Because uh, nowadays, earlier we used to say, uh, uh, slow and steady wins the race. That was the proverb which we learned in our uh, childhood days. Slow and steady wins the race. But I am sure that those are, gone are those days. Now I believe fast and steady. Fast and steady is the order of the day. For example, the, the descendants of uh, the particular rabbit, now they, those rabbits, the new rabbits in the, in the 21st century, definitely uh, that, these young rabbits, they, definitely they will complete their target and then they will go for a sleep. Am I right? So, uh, fast and steady is the order of the day. Uh, survival of the fittest uh, is a must. So, whatever said and done, when you analyze successful people, these are the, some of the, some of the uh, tips which we can analyze in general from any walks of life. Again, uh, if you think we can stretch our limits, if you think. Otherwise, if you think that, okay, I am comfortable, I am happy, I am contented, then uh, you won't attempt again. Whereas, whereas, if you are ready to stretch your limits, if you are ready to stretch your limits, sky is the limit. For that, we have to, we ourselves have to change our attitude, change our attitude. In this context, let me explain uh, some of my experience in my life. I started, uh, as you know, uh, in a small way, just a, as a tiny industry with the two workers. Initial days, uh, as you know, I was the marketing manager, I was the 
the purchase manager, I was the accounts manager because no other staff was there. Only two, um, uh, two workers as well as he failed. I had only a, a Lambi scooter. Many of you old people may be knowing Lambi scooter. Yeah, good. I had a Lambi old scooter. Uh, so no other manager. So I was the uh, all in all. But years gone, uh, um, the, the company has progressed. Um, we, uh, the turnover has increased. We appointed engineers, we appointed supervisors, managers. Then, then, then I noticed further if you want to improve, further if I want to improve myself, uh, further if you want to take the company to higher levels, I myself have to improve. That is a lesson which I learned from my life. That was uh, a stage when uh, we, we had around uh, 120 employees that time, I took a decision, okay, I will improve my skills, skills. For your information, um, I studied in a Malayalam medium school, uh, born and brought up in a very, very remote village. So my English was so poor, I was not able to address few gathering, a few people, gather, very difficult. So I purposely attended a number of training programs as far as English language is concerned. Written as well as spoken, definitely I had attended. Then again, I attended a number of training programs connected with uh, public speaking, personality development. Literally, I attended. In those days, uh, my wife Sheila was not that happy because the children was uh, so young, two years and uh, four years. Uh, so every time I must, I must, I will have some evening class. I have. So she thought uh, I am trying to escape from the responsibilities of uh, family. Uh, somehow, uh, she thought, uh, she even, uh, they said, no, her brothers are also into business, so they are not attending these type of activities. Why you, you are going for that training program? One time, once I attended a, a, a training program conducted by a chartered accountant for traders. He organized a training program for uh, uh, the local traders, how to read balance sheet, how to read a uh, profit and loss account. Simple, simple. Until that time, I never had an opportunity to go through what is meant by balance sheet. I used to wonder, both sides are equal. <laughs> yeah, then some, sometimes they say debt at the same time, credit. Yeah, anyway, confusing, confusing. So I attended a training program particularly for that. And similarly, I tried to attend a number of training programs for your information. I had a uh, one-week uh, uh, in-house training program at uh, Hyderabad Staff Training College regarding creativity. Uh, so that was a crazy period at that time. That was a crazy period at that time. Uh, I used to attend a number of training programs. When I look back, when I look back, when compared to many other industrialists, that is one of the reasons for my success which I believe uh, could, uh, could uh, motivate even the other managers. Because when you are leading a group of people, the, the, the problem is uh, the, the people will look upon you. They expect something more because all others are also intelligent. Your managers are also intelligent. Uh, your engineers are also in intelligent. Uh, your accountant also intelligent. So unless and until you perform slightly, slightly better than them, then they will find out some other job. <laughs> they will find out some other job. <laughs> so it is our duty as a leader. It is our duty to uh, to improve our skills. That is the message which I learned uh, from. Then again, uh, uh, try to try to know your weaknesses. That is the main thing. Try to know your uh, weaknesses and try to improve your uh, your skills. Unless and until you you yourself identify your own weaknesses, you cannot improve yourself. Normally, the managing director, even if he is a, is a muffin, uh, managers don't worry uh, uh, yeah, uh, there is a story, uh, in, uh, in fact.